Good morning, Trinity families. Have you heard the word? What's the word? Today comes from, on this Monday, 2 Corinthians chapter 5, verse 17. We are starting a new week with a new word, and I'm wearing a new shirt, which I did not plan to match the playground equipment. Sweet. And we are starting a new camp. Together We Grow Camp at Trinity are starting on Mondays all through the summer. So we are super excited. And it is so hot today that Frederick is sitting in a new place, not on my shoulder. He's hanging out on the playground equipment. Glad you're here, Frederick. All right, let's dig into our faith adventure. New word, 2 Corinthians 5.17, repeat after me. And I think it's good to say it out loud. Anyone who belongs to Christ has become a new person. The old life is gone, a new life has begun. The old life is gone, a new life has begun. So the sign language for new is like a plant coming up from the soil out of the ground, growing, made new, new life. Can you make that sign? And you, my friends, are new, a new creation. When Jesus died and rose, he promised to leave us his Holy Spirit. We have the Holy Spirit in us that makes us a new creation every day. And when we're a new creation, we get to live for God and not ourselves because our old sinful ways and self, boom, nailed to the cross and left there. And Paul's talking to these young believers in Corinth and he is reminding them, being a new creation is actually your status. This is who you are. And so let's leave those old sinful ways, the bad habits behind, and live in the hope and promise of today. Because this is your status, I want you to say this with me, but put in your name. <laughs> My name is Mary Bluebaum, and I am a new creation. Go for it. Yes, so sweet new creations. Let's take time to pray to the one who made us new, Jesus. Lord, we wanna praise you right now for who you are. And I praise you for being a redeemer. Lord, you tell us to confess our sins to you where we have fallen short. Lord, I am sorry for bad habits, ones that I wanna hold on to that aren't good because they keep me from you. And Lord, you tell us to come to you in thanks. I thank you so much for the new relationships we're gonna to make today at Monday Camp. And Father, we're to bring our requests to you knowing you supply our needs. And so I'm asking in this day and in this week where it's gonna be super hot, would you watch over and protect all of us? Uh, keep us hydrated, not only with water, but with living water, boom. All right, in the powerful name of Jesus, we are praying these things. Can I hear an amen? Amen. All right, now let's play What's the Park? On Friday, I was at, drum roll please, O'Neill West Chestnut. Yes, under major construction because they're making a new pool, super cool, and skate park. But they have a huge playground set that you can still go to and there's baseball and softball and football. There's a million things that happen at O'Neill, so check it out. Now today's park, as you can see, is very orange and green. I'm going to scan around so you can check it out. And I'm just curious how many of you have actually gotten every park right so far. You have got to let me know. And again, we're doing the honor policy. So we'll see, but find out tomorrow where I'm at today. In the meantime, happy new creation Monday, word up and God bless.